Howdy howdy and hello everybody and welcome back to another fantastic episode of Husky Tales here in our Wonder World. Which as you can see last night, the emerald made us back to normal. I am finally my green fuzzy self again. Um, it was fun being orange and it was fun seeing the world in a different view but I, I kind of missed this view. I will definitely say though, the emerald is powerful and I can't wait to see what it does next time. So we'll, we'll have to remember that. But we have to get some serious talk guys. Last video, we lost someone very, very important to us. Um, if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, stop the video here and go look at last chapter and you guys will see what I'm talking about. Um, so I did a little building on the side. We have another project today, but I'm going to go over here guys. Uh, I left my door open apparently too, right there. <laughs> um, but before we do anything, first off, actually, we're going to start on a happy note. A very happy note, because I am going to show you guys who I've added to the Puppy Pal Grove. We're going to hop out here and go over here. Because today, guys, I have added, and hopefully I say the name right, <gasps> MC Duckface. And the reason I'm adding MC Duckface is because I asked you guys for Creation Corner to send me your stuff. That's, you know, part of the Creation Corner, <laughs> Creation Corner themes. And, you know, obviously I put those in my Creation Corner series. But the video, or the the pictures and stuff you send me that aren't part of the Creation Corner that are just for me, or just as a thank you gift from you guys, I consider as just a, well, thank you gift. And MC, Duckface right here, actually gave me this wonderful little drawing, which hopefully should be popping up on the screen now somewhere, on one of the corners of the screen. And there's this fun little thing that she did, which I really loved. And you've also been a long-time supporter. You comment a lot in the videos, and you're just really, like, awesome. I mean, all you guys are awesome, really. But, yes, MC, Duckface, oh, that's the wrong button. <laughs> yes, MC, I wanted to thank you, and I wanted to say welcome to the Puppy Pal Grove. And as per usual, we are going to dig in a little doggy spot for you, because this doggy bone is for you. And we're going to bury that bone right there. And if you guys are wondering, Husky, how do I get into the Puppy Pal Grove? Where have you guys been at? <laughs> um, it's simple, really. All you guys have to do is do something nice. Comment my videos, share them, like them, uh, draw me something, do something fun like that, you know, etc. Things like that make me smile, and when I smile, it makes everyone smile. Actually, I don't know. But it does actually get you into the Puppy Pal Grove. So, yes, yeah, so welcome again, MC Duckface, and again, welcome to anybody, all of our wonderful little friends here. Yeah, see, we have like almost our first row filled here, actually. Look at this. Look at this. That is a lot of people. But yes, guys, serious time now. As you guys remember, if you guys said haven't seen last chapter, stop right now. Go watch it. Oh, that reminds me too. I need to get down here really quick. But if you guys have not seen last chapter, it's sand, sand, glass. Okay. If you guys have not seen last chapter, um, unfortunately, guys, we did lose a very special friend right here. I don't know if she's gone for good. I don't know if she just ran away. Um, it, I, I'm sure she's fine, guys. We just gotta, we'll have to find her sometime. When Mr. Wolf gets back, maybe he'll help us. So in honor, guys, of dearest Emma, um, you guys can see our tree house is all fancy now because of our, our back to our old world. I decided to change the name of the treehouse, guys. It is now called Emma's Treerific Tower. And I'm gonna climb up here and show you guys. Um, I want to like, I know I was gonna like build this with you guys like on the screen, but after what happened, I wanted to make it a little more special. And so now that when you climb to the top, guys, there is a little balcony here. You guys can still see over our land. You guys can see everything still, see? See, I gotta explore this area over here sometime. But then guys, if you come in here, we have Emma's Tower. Rest in peace, never forgotten. And this is just a little place to remember dearest Emma. Um, if she if she's actually okay guys and we find her, we'll change the tower back to a happy place. But for now, I just wanna sit here and remember all the fun times that we had with Emma. Because you know, we didn't get to take her out on a lot of adventures, but we did take her out on some. Uh, we got to take her out farming with us that one time, and well, she was also waiting for us when we came back from that weird swamp place. And So, you know, Emma, if you are out there, this tower will help us find you. We'll have to, like, 
come up here once a chapter and see if we can see where you're at. Maybe you did run into the water over here, or maybe you ran into the water over here somewhere, or maybe over there. Um, cause I think there's water over here too, like further that way. But um, I should probably not do that with my luck of falling. Yeah, guys, we do have a another project. Um, and so it actually involves that horrible lava pit. Um, you guys remember last chapter? I told you guys I was going to hopefully fix it, and I plan to fix it now. Um, I've never thought of it as a big threat, but apparently it is. So that's what this glass is, because I do like the light that it gives off, like the actual light, but it is very dangerous. So I'm going to go put our sand in a furnace to start making some glass. And then I'm going to kind of start getting some, I'm going to get some cobblestone too. And I won't be taking any doggies with me just because I'm working near lava. And I don't want another accident to happen. So I'm going to throw sand in there. And sand in there. Do I have any coal in here? I don't. I have steak though. Um, Alright, so I'm going to have to get some coal later. And I will go do it right now. We're down here. Because I have to go get cobblestone anyways. Because I'm going to basically, what I'm going to do guys, is make this little cobblestone wall. And here it is. Get some cobblestone. Make a cobblestone wall of sorts. And I'm going to kind of like make a little glass dome of sorts as well. I, you know I keep saying of sorts. Um, it's kind of the word of the day. Of sorts. Um, and so we're just basically going to make like a little dome. So we have the light of the lava, but no one will have to worry about falling in. Because that's, yeah, that's no good. Am I right? Alright, so we got those cooking. I feel weird to say I have I have sand cooking. That's not something you normally say, I don't think. Um, I'm gonna hop over to here and just kind of start working on this little enclosure. And hopefully, I don't die in the process either, because I feel like I could. Like I feel like with my luck, it's very likely to happen. So we're just gonna start putting this down. If you guys have any ideas for what I should do instead of maybe a dome. Like, maybe I should actually make this into, like, some sort of thing. Should I get... I don't know if I want to get rid of... I kind of want to get rid of it, actually. I probably should, considering what it did. Um, but I'll let you guys decide what's going to happen, what's going to go on here. Um, so, as you're watching this, think of things that I can do with this lava, or things I don't need to worry about with this lava, because... Like I said, I'm not sure if I want to keep it, or if I just want to say good riddance and throw water on it. I could use it. I could mine it for obsidian when I go make my. Because I have to go to the Nether some point. Um, if you guys remember, I talked about that briefly. Um, to get some stuff for like my town, our little city I'm going to make, make be making. So I guess I could use it as like a Nether little obsidian place. Um, I could always like build the portal in here. No, no. So yeah, guys. Uh, like I said, I'm going to build this. And give me your ideas why I build this. Um, I think I'm just, that's good. So I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna put, actually here. So I'm gonna put a dirt block here, and just go glass. There we go. And then I think I'm gonna have to go around all the way. So it's like this little dome shape. So it'll be like this, and then put it there. There we go. And also guys, there is some good news though. Mr. Wolf will be returning very shortly, hopefully. Um, He's been saying his journey's been good, and he has some goodies to bring back. I mean, who doesn't like souvenirs, right? Souvenirs are amazing. Um, and I plan to work on our city once I get some nether stuff. I think, for sure, we're going to have to, like, go into the nether at some point and just, like, see what's all in there, see what we can, like, get, as well as, like, you know, supplies, of course. And then I said, you know, every chapter, guys, I'm going to try to climb up on Emma's treehouse tower and see if maybe we can see her. Um, I don't know if we will be able to or not, but you know what? I have hope because I don't think Emma is truly gone. I mean, what do you guys think? In the comments below, as you guys are telling me what to do with this dome, <laughs> I'm probably going to have you guys spam my comments this chapter. Um, do you guys think she's gone? Do you guys think she's, you know, watching us from above? Or do you guys think she's just, like, hiding somewhere? What do you guys think? I want to know 
because it helps me know what to feel. Because I don't want to think I lost Emma. We've been doing so good, and we haven't lost any doggies, and I'm just, I don't want to think that she's gone. Right? Am I right, guys? I, d I, don't, I don't think she's gone. She can't be gone. So I'm going to sit here. I don't mind me as I talk, as I kind of work on this little thing here. Um, I just thought it'd be kind of fun to work on. And like I said, it needs to happen because, yeah. So yeah, basically this is what it's going to kind of look like. And then um, once I get more sand, which I will do here in a second, basically I'm just going to go like this on top. And like I said, it's going to be basically a dome shape. Um, so yeah. And if you guys don't know, I don't know if I will have hit the mark by now. Um, but I am also really close to a thousand puppy pal guys. And so... If I have hit the mark, thank you. You guys will expect a special video out soon. If I have not hit the mark, then you know if you like what you like, if you like what you're watching, you know hit that subscribe button, guys. Um, I'm just really focused on like building this little igloo. That's what I should call it. So it's a lava igloo, the lava igloo of evilness, apparently. Um, skeleton. Should we go beat up a skeleton? I feel like I don't beat up. I feel like I don't beat up the mobs on camera enough, and so everyone's like kind of what left wondering how I get my levels or where they all go or like my experience and all that which I don't know where my levels went actually um I kind of like notice that it's x3 I swore it was more than that um weird um like it's um here oh you get experience from these too um well it is nighttime guys so I'm gonna hurry and take a quick little nap and then we're gonna finish up our uh, little igloo over there. And I'm just gonna, like, this is gonna be like one of those little side projects I do just because, you know, I want to get it out of the way. Ah, nap times are great, aren't they? Oh, there we go. I don't know why it paused me like that. Rude. Okay. So, yes, guys, I'm gonna go finish the igloo now. Whoa, I'm all over the place. I feel like I'm going really fast. Like, I don't know if I actually am, but I feel like I'm going really fast. Um,. So we're going to come over here, guys, and finish this little igloo. I want to try to finish it all right now. Um, that's my goal is to try to finish it in this chapter. That way, you know, next chapter we can actually do more fun stuff. And if you guys have ideas, by the way, for things I should do either in the future town or the carnival or even here on our farm in our land, uh, let me know. And uh, I'll take it into consideration because, like I said, this is a wonder world for all of us. So it can only be for all of us if we all have our little say in what goes on here. Because, you know, I like hearing what you guys think. You guys are actually really creative. I like some of the stuff you guys have said uh, in the past. Um, am, am I just babbling today? Because I feel like I'm babbling. Um, but I babble a lot, actually. So it's quite common to hear a husky babble. It's my husky howling powers. Ah! Don't fall in the lava. Don't. No. Why did I... No! Stone. Do I have a pickaxe? I don't. <sighs> Alright, sit here and watch me break through cobblestone. Yay! Might just fast forward this. Okay, and it's broke. So we're gonna put that there. And put that there. And we'll put this dirt here. There, 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 and there. Aha, see? Looking good. So I think this next little top part here, actually, I'm going to go like this. Make like a even square shape of sorts without falling in. And then I'm going to go like this. Put that piece there. Put that piece there. And we're just going to go like this now. Yeah, let's just do this. We'll just top it all off. Oop. Not that part, though. Here, here, and here. There we go. And that, guys, is our lava igloo. Um, I might put a door or something here. No, no, I probably shouldn't. I'll just put a little hopping stone here. Um, so, yeah, guys, like I said, I just wanted to um, work on this little ow, project um, just because recent events. Um, I might do something fun with it if you guys suggest something cool. Um, hop on up here 
uh, you guys suggest something cool, I will definitely take it into consideration, and we'll make something awesome out of this. If not, I might just get rid of it, I don't know. Um, why is there a sheep on the fence over there? You guys see him back there? It's like back there. Um, but yes, guys, short, sort of a short episode today, so, you know, welcome MC Duckface to our Puppy Pal Grove, by the way. And you guys, like I said, if you guys want to join the Grove, do the things listed before. Um, I just wanted to finish this little project in today's chapter. Next chapter, we'll find something fun to do. Maybe, maybe in the comments below. I keep saying in the comments below the today. Let me know what I should do in the next chapter. Should I do some nether hunting, or like, another obsidian hunting, or should I build something, or what should I do? What should I do, guys? Tell me. Um, or maybe a quest to actually go find Emma. I don't know. So, let me know what you guys think. And I will read and consider what to do next chapter. And yeah, I will see you guys then, I guess. So until next time, guys, bye!